What is going on, viewers of YouTube? Some buddy here, guys. My status slash coverage on San Diego Comic Con 2016. In this video, we're going to be checking out the Hot Toys display for Suicide Squad. First off, we do have the Joker in his little silver and red uh, suit, looking absolutely stunning. This is actually a reuse of the head sculpt for the Toy Fair exclusive, but it, I'm sure, is bound to change. And uh, in person, the tailoring on this guy is really, really nice. I love the suit. And it's not puffy or anything. It's really just has great proportions. And here I was trying to zoom in on his hands because they do have tattoos on them. And, uh, you know, attention to detail is a big part of Hot Toys. So I do like to show it. do have the rings on the, fig on the fingers as well. So it looks pretty, pretty cool. Hopefully it comes with an extra hand for the gesture where he like puts uh, his hand on his mouth and there's like the fake mouth on his back hand. <laughs> does come with his uh, purple pistols as well so this here is his henchman eyeball man looking pretty cool I don't think I'll pick up this guy but uh you know it's nice to know that Hot Toys made this guy I don't I don't think personally he'll sell too well I don't know who would really want this but I mean, it's very cool looking but I prefer to get the classic main uh, DC heroes and villains so but great detail love the tailoring and yep here's another one of his henchmen very anime-esque Sean Lon said this in his video very anime-esque and I was struggling here to get the least amount of glare possible but yeah his head sculpt's really cool actually reminds me of Pac-Man as well so it's really cool looking I'm loving this <laughs> it looks really neat the weapon detail is really amazing too. So, cool henchman, cool Joker, all round, really nice looking. Considering this guy, just because he's really classy, I don't know why. I should probably just not do it, but you know. Here's the uh, Toy Fair exclusive Joker, same head sculpt as the suited version, but uh, very beautiful piece. Love the tailoring. Straight jacket is amazing. The uh, goth or the Arkham pants are really, are really cool as well. Doesn't have shoes. Poor Joker. Feet are gonna get cold. I love the background too. The chair and I believe he, yeah he comes with that card as well. If I'm not mistaken, I mean that could just be there. But uh, I really love the background for this thing. It's very very beautiful. Kind of want it, <laughs> but I don't have space unfortunately. But here is the big guy, Deadshot with the Will Smith uh, head sculpt and it looks like I don't think I've ever seen a hot toy sculpt that is this perfect this is Will Smith the only other Will Smith figure they've done is uh, Jay from uh, Men in Black but the amount of detail they put on the suit is beautiful he has so many pockets and zippers and uh, holsters it is ridiculous I'm definitely gonna pick this guy up I'm gonna use the classic masked uh, head sculpt just because you know Deadshot's a big part of my childhood I love the figures and the uh, DC Universe figure is actually one of my favorites so I can't wait to pick this guy up it is so nice looking yeah and there's the uh, the masked head sculpt which I'm gonna use it's just it is so nice looking very classic wish he had a bit more red somewhat more white but uh, you know it is the movie universe and here is the primary Joker looking really nice he does have his classic well not really classic has weird scales on it but it's his purple trench coat looking really nice and he has freaking Batman PJs on come on actually they're not really PJs as much as they're you know for kind of boxing shorts but uh, yeah you can actually take the trench coat off and he has a full rubber body underneath with all the tattoos and here we do have Harley Quinn and she is ridiculously sexy I'm gonna pick her up not just not I'm not being a perv people just because Harley Quinn's one of my favorite DC villains so you gotta have her and that head sculpt is really nice it, it just even for a prototype it is just stunning looks exactly like uh, uh, Margaret Robbie that's how you even pronounce her name but uh, yeah, really beautiful piece. Loving it. Love her hammer that she comes with too. And yeah, she actually comes with the uh, jacket as well. 
So, that's a nice touch. Ah, if only she wore her classic gesture outfit. If only. Accessories, uh, pretty generic, just hands and such. Love the hair sculpt, too. It's really nice. I love all these different... You know, they're, Hot Toys really going out there with their facial expressions. So, with the Doc Brown and her, so it's, it's nice to have it change than just that serious look. But uh, here was the big reveal. The Joker Batman, question mark? God, I hope this is not a spoiler. Because this is too damn cool. I'm probably not going to pick this up. It's really tempting because... Just look at that head sculpt. It is so great. One thing I don't understand about this. Uh, how is he so buff? Joker is not that buff. So. But hey. <laughs> I ain't judging. And if you guys are wondering on his belt, that is not an R for Robin. That is an X. Just saying. Here is the uh, Suicide Squad uh, Batman resp with the uh, respirator as well. So there's honestly no difference between this guy and the standard Batman v Superman Batman other than this guy comes with the handcuffs and the, uh, the respirator as well, which I'm pretty sure is removable. It's not confirmed yet, but I'm almost 100% sure it is. And I do love that there's the bat symbol on the front of the respirator. That is so damn cool. And uh, some Cos Baby stuff. I think I spent way too much time on this, honestly. Not a big fan of it, but I know some people are. I'm not judging. You know, some of these are really cute, like that Harley Quinn in the Arkham suit. So, really cute. Now, this is a huge line, so I'm sure they're going to do be doing plenty more Jokers and Harleys, but uh, if you did enjoy this video, please like, subscribe, comment, check out my site at sunspotreviews.com, and I will see you guys in my next video.